this is a pivotal moment in the history of science. Absolutely. In physics and chemistry. Yeah. Absolutely. Because it's not just... And it's a moment when physics and chemistry really meet. And they meet society in a fundamental way. Would you say that the concept of radioactivity and its value to dating things for their age all began with Marie Curie? Is that a fair credit to give? Yes. She wasn't doing that work, but other people in her lab were. If something is radioactive, it, you have a certain amount of that substance in your sample. If it's radioactive, it's changing identity. It's becoming another element. Right. right? It's very alchemical, isn't it? Oh, look at look that. Look at that. Yeah. Which was a big problem at first. Changing one element into another. <laughs> yeah. Is that even possible? Right. Because we'd already given up on alchemy. Exactly. Right? If you know the rate at which it's changing, and you know how much you started with, you'll know how old the sample is. Right. Because how long it's been there. Oh my gosh, how useful that is, especially to, to geologists. The age of the Earth was determined in the wake of these discoveries. And it was much older than anybody had thought. Yeah. Older than 6,000 6, years. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? You <Long>. think? So? <laughs> you think? That's so funny. Yeah. <laughs>